Thank you, everybody, for all your prayers and all your support. We really appreciate it. We appreciate it every year, but I think we appreciate it more this year than ever before because this has turned out to be the toughest year for us in all of our 20 years. Uh, so thank you very much for everybody that continues to hold us in your hearts. Um, I'm really pleased to give you some good news. Uh, we have uh, 52 students in out of 423 who have received uh, some of the highest awards in their school. High honours and also 16 is the Dean's Lister, which makes them top of their course in the whole of their college. Uh, and we also had a, another 16 students who received their classroom awards as well. So giving us a total of, of 68. So really delighted that despite living in those very tiny shanties without running water, often without electrical supplies and in very cramped conditions, our students still performed as if they were doing face-to-face -face classes. And incredibly, 100% of our students graduated uh, they've moved up um, to another year group um, with their pass mark being 80% and above. So it couldn't be a more successful program. We are absolutely delighted. And I personally would like to thank everybody that sponsors children or gives some money to us in our in the regular giving. Uh, because that just invariably goes back into the education. Um, and these are life changing programs for the students. Um, this summer, they've been working on leadership and they've been, been running leadership programs for our students, which they've been sending me messages and saying how good that is for them to be on. So that's really good news and super news about our farm. So uh, we just took recently a delivery of another 200 chickens. Uh, so we now have 390. We are definitely getting closer to our goal of 600. Um, we're producing uh, around about between 1,500 and 2,000 eggs a week uh, and are about to sell 500 eggs a week to a local NGO that lives not far from the farm. So that will be our very first wholesale client. The eggs, of course, are providing um, very, very good protein and healthy fats for our feeding program. Um, and as time goes on, um, we're hoping that we'll be able to give six eggs, uh, to all of our students in our, in our, um, monthly food packs for them. So it's really been a successful program. We've got somebody who's like a night watchman looking out for those vermin and those snakes. Uh, but the houses are really well uh, built and well protected. Uh, and the biggest challenge we have is just picking up the eggs because, of course, they don't just lay in the morning. They lay morning, noon and night. Um, but it's been a really, it's been a really, really lovely program. And our students have been able to visit, um, the farm and have really enjoyed their experiences. So thank you because you have put money towards this program. Um, our goal is to have, really 600 chickens by the end of the year um, and if we can we would like to expand that even further um, and go for 800 um, in 2023. I think after that we've run out of space um, but yeah thank you very much all of you and uh, our health clinics which fortunately are fully funded for um, for this year have been going more regularly to the remote areas where we have families who can't access healthcare. Uh, and that's been really helpful because a local NGO has offered us the use of their building so that we can now hold the clinic, um, not under tarpauling, but actually in their building, which means that we'll be able to serve even more people. So that's been really good news. Um, and, uh, we have, um, new products that we're bringing out um, for, uh, for for this year. Some are already in our newsletter. I hope some of you have received our newsletter already. Um, others uh, will be coming out in the Christmas period. So thank you, everybody. Please, anybody who wants to talk to me, um, my contact details are at the end of this video. Um, please just send me a message. Um, and yeah, it's been lovely, lovely giving you the update and thank you so much again for your prayers.